Congratulations on getting a Roblox bag for your team. It's really simple to put it together, but we're going to walk you through it just to show you if there's any questions. As you open up the box, there will be two main pieces. You'll have the bag that's wrapped itself, and uh, we'll take care of that first, and then you'll have the inserts, the walls, the foam, and the frame, and make sure you grab all of those pieces, set them aside for now. As you unfold the bag, it's going to match the shape that's in the assembly diagram that we included. So lay that out and then go ahead and grab the walls so that you can match them up with each of the pieces. The back three are all one size, so they're interchangeable. The front and the top portion are the ones that's laid out more long in front of us here. So lay those out, go ahead and put the foam with each of them. You're going to insert that just at the same time. And then uh, once you have all of that laid out, it's really quite simple to get the pieces and slide them into place. To insert the walls, just open up the Velcro flap on the back portion of each. Have one person hold that open while another lines up the foam with the wall, slides it down into place. Uh, should be quite simple. You might need to adjust the foam just a little so it's not bunched up. Take that Velcro, pull it over, and fold it. Secure that into place and repeat this for each of these back walls. These front two walls are slightly different shapes, so take note of piece B and piece C. They have a different tapered, slightly different measurement. So match those according to your instruction sheet, put the foam on them, and then insert them the same as we just inserted in the back. Open this Velcro flap, have one person hold it open while you slide that into place. Uh, keep the foam flat and long there, and fold it closed and secure the Velcro. Repeat this for both of these pieces. Once all the walls are in place, just roll it forward like this so that you can easily zip down that back side. And as you bring the zippers around the corner, be careful not to tug too tight. Anytime you zip on a corner, you want to do it carefully so that you don't have extra wear and tear on the bag and your zipper is going to last a lot longer for you. As you unfold your frame, you're going to want to make sure that this groove is open to the top so that this is where you can put the extra bar in place when your robot's inserted and then make sure this swing arm goes down and attaches on this pin. Now in the bag you're going to want to open each of these velcro flaps so that they're ready to receive the frame as you slide it into place. So go ahead and open each of these and as you slide the frame in place we recommend having one person lift up on each of the side walls so that you can pull the flap and secure the velcro tightly then put the base in position and slide these flaps and secure them as well at this point you're basically done with assembly if you want you can have this extra rod to hold your robot in place when you put it in and out and as you zip up the bag everything will be secure and protected inside of there remember be careful with the zippers on the corners and uh, last thing, in one of the side pockets, you're going to find a bundle of your straps, the tie-down and shoulder strap that's included with your bag. We've provided these straps for you so that you can easily lift and pull the bag, as well as easily secure things to the top. For the tie-down straps, there's provided clips there, and the straps are adjustable. Whether you want to put a toolbox or a small pump, you can secure anything that you want to the top of your bag. For the shoulder strap, if you just clip onto the handles that are provided, uh, it'll easily help you to lift and pull so that you can move your bag around with ease. Each clip on the shoulder strap is rated to hold over 100 pounds and the most heavy duty ones we could find. There's two handles to hold if you want to grab it with another person to go up and down stairs. And now everything's put together, your Robox bag is ready to go.